Uh, growing up on the farm was, uh, I think it's a great best, first of all, I think it's the best place for a kid to grow up. Uh, you have the ability to teach a kid to work, and uh, that's not always to the kids' liking, but that's a, a great thing to be able to do because you have the ability to put your kid out to work all the time. He goes with you and, and does things like that. Growing up, my dad was a small farmer and only growing a few hundred acres. My brother and I, uh, we would go with him every day on a daily basis, help him change his water and do things. And uh, as we were young, uh, I don't know how old we were, but my brother and I, we, uh, we would help my dad every day and we would move the, go get the Jeep and move it up. We were too small to really be driving the Jeep, but I would sit on the floor and run the gas and the brake and my brother would drive the steering wheel and he would tell me how fast to go and when to stop. And uh, we were, we ran into several ditches. My dad had to put up with a lot, I think, back then. But uh, one day we had came home and we dropped my dad off at the house and, and my brother was driving and I was running the brakes and the gas and we went to park the Jeep in the garage and uh, we missed the door of the garage and uh, we hit the pole and about knocked the garage down, but uh, it was interesting. Uh, you know, <laughs> so that's one of the memories I have of, of growing up there as a young kid. I mean, it, it's, I think it's really a good thing. Uh, we have three, gen- see, four generations on the farm today. Uh, my kids have kids today, and they go with their dads out there, and uh, they live to be in the tractor and... Uh, have those experiences and it's, it'll be exciting to see that it's really kind of exciting to see this go on to another generation to be able to be passed down to to build a legacy that can continue and to to, to go forth and and ho- hopefully keep it together for many generations to come well you guys have grown a lot in the last couple of years so we'll need more families <laughs> <laughs> no I, I have eight grandkids and under three years of old and they're all boys oh wow so uh, we're, we're, we're on a run right now. We got, and we got a lot of boys coming to work. So uh, 